Hey everyone, welcome to another episode of Nerd Herders. My name is Rich. I'm Nick. I'm Dana. And today is another round of 20 questions. Hmm. Holy moly. Uh, this week is Nick's week to pick the movie. So if you're just joining us, um, if this is your first time watching, every week we do a game of 20 questions. One of the three of us picks the movie. The other two have to guess it. 20 questions to do so. Really 19, as she likes to point out, because you have to guess it by the 20th question. If you guess the movie before that 20th question and get it wrong, you lose automatically. So somebody can't sit here and go, is it this movie? Is it that movie? Is it this movie? Hmm. Um, this week is Nick's movie. Now, Nick, is this your movie or is this a viewer submission? This is my movie. Okay. I would I would say that I, I, was, I was told, I was informed by a viewer that last week, and I don't know if this is true or not, but last week when you picked the movie, and if you remember, we got it on the last guess. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Uh, I was told that we, we used 23 guesses. I don't know. I don't know. Controversy. Oh, so you didn't win. Controversy. Well, if that's anybody's fault, it's it would be Dana's Dana, fault yeah. for not keeping better track of the questions. Who was that? Uh, Malolo. Who was that? Oh. Let us know. Oh, I like him. <laughs> I trust him. I don't know him, so I don't trust him. I would, I would trust him. But anyway, I picked the movie this week. Okay. It is my choice, my choice alone, and okay. you shall begin. All right. Um, was this movie released prior to January 1st, 2000? It was. Okay. Was this movie released prior to January 1st, 1990? It was not. Okay. So it's a 90s movie. Mm-hmm. Is this movie live action? It is. Knew that. <laughs> well, one of these days, someone's going to pick a not live action movie, you and we're going to assume it's live that. action. Um, I know, so I keep waiting for it to happen. Anything you want to guess, Dana? Um, not yet. Okay. Um, is this movie rated R? No. Okay. You don't know what the genre is. I know. That's my next route. Um, Family friendly. No, you can you can do your route. Is this movie a comedy? Yeah. Okay. I wasn't looking, but he seemed a little hesitant. Well, he wasn't hesitant. He was just like, yeah, like kind of, I don't know if he's he's either fucking with us or he's just like, yes, it technically is. So it could be like a family movie or something. Mm -hmm. um, is this movie a family movie? Like, could, could this be a all ages? Kind of. I don't think that you would initially... I don't think that it would be... It sort of is. Okay. But not in, like, a, as an example of something that more recently came out. Like, it's not a deliberately family movie. Like, okay. Like, like a Disney cartoon. Okay. And with that said, I think that all ages would see this movie. So in that way, yes. Okay. Fair enough? Sure. That's six. I'm not uh, sure that's helped us at all. Is this movie fresh on Rotten Tomatoes? Yes. So a well reviewed. I'm gonna confirm that, but Okay. Yes. Hmm. It is. So a comedy No. Oh yeah, yeah. yeah that's comedy. A nineties comedy suitable for all ages. That's live action. That's fresh on Rotten Tomatoes. Mm -hmm. Is this movie star a cast member from Saturday Night Live? No. That's eight. Is this movie holiday themed? It was terrible. Why? Do you know what the movie is? Yes, I know what the movie is. It's I, I feel like it might involve a holiday, but not in any traditional way. Okay. I, so I'm going to say no. Okay. I could be wrong about so that, like, but my thought is no. <clears throat> So it could be something. It's 
this wasn't made then, but something, you know, Harry Potter has Christmas scenes in it. It's not a Christmas movie. Sure. Whereas Jingle All the Way is a Christmas movie. Clearly. Okay. I, I'm, it might not even, so I'm, I'm thinking now. Okay. I'm not sure if he's aware of the movie he chose. I think he is. I think we're just not on... Is this movie based on another property? It is. Okay. What, what is it? Nine? Ten. Ten. Um, is this movie... Does it have sequels? It does. Okay, so a franchise... Family movie. Some, uh, not family movie, but comedic movie Home for Home. all ages. That's a Christmas movie. Is it? Yes, Home Alone <laughs> is a Christmas movie. Gremlins. That's also a Christmas movie. Is it? And that was also made in the 80s. Is it? A Chris- it doesn't say that it's the first one. We don't know if it's that the That there's first nothing movie. after the second one. Yeah, there it is. There's no Gremlins 3. This movie has sequels. Is that 11? We're at 11, right? Okay. I'll just stop helping then. No, I don't mean for you to stop helping. Ooh. Um, no, I don't think he would have... I'm trying to think of... I was trying to think, too, but... <laughs> <laughs> I know, and I was... Well, like, I shutting just looked... Down I'm not shutting you I down. Said. But, like, I just looked over Jurassic Park. But he wouldn't have any reason to think... That that's there's, Christmas? That, well, there, I didn't say Christmas, I said Holiday. That has a holiday in it, or wouldn't be well reviewed on Rotten Tomatoes. Mm-hmm. So I don't think it's something like that. But I could be wrong. I mean, mm-hmm. unless he's just again, he could be just screwing with us. And well, maybe he just wanted to double check to make sure. I'm sure there are movies that I think would be positive on Rotten Tomatoes, and they are not. <laughs> That's because you like movies like Norbit and That's a good one. Christmas with the Cranks. <laughs> Also a good one. Um, I should look up the rating of that. I bet it's low. You're low. A movie with sequels from the nineties. Are the sequels from the nineties? We don't know. Mm, that's true too. Are they still making mm. these movies today, or within like within the last like couple of years, or something coming out? Yes. Mm, mm, mm. You think it is? So it could be something like a Jurassic Park. Should we ask if there's dinosaurs? You could ask if is there's... Is there any... anybody in there that would be on Saturday Night Live? No. I also wouldn't consider it a comedy, though, either. Jurassic World. I know Jurassic World just came out, but I wouldn't <laughs> consider Jurassic Park to be a comedy. Did it have funny elements? Uh, yeah, there were a couple... Comedic Wait, moments. So, in what it. are some other movies that are <clears throat> similar to that? Was that rated PG? Uh, I think it was. Is that PG-13. the rating that we got? Yeah, we we just got not R. Oh, not R. R. <sighs> so it can't be pirates. No, that was two thousand three. Uh, it's still getting sequels. You got twelve. I'm, thank you. No one asked. <laughs> well, what are they still making? Uh, the Apes movies? Yeah, but so I wouldn't consider those comedies in the first one was in the 60s. I mean, we could double check that this is the first one. Is this the first... You don't laugh at those gorillas? <laughs> is this the first movie in the franchise? It is. Okay. Um... Toy Story, but I would that's, that, that would be very much a family. But that's um, animated. Yeah. We said live action. I know. Oh. I'm. So like you're I'm, shutting me down when I'm. I'm right not. No, I'm not shutting you down. I'm just. I'm agree. Yes, I'm agreeing with you. Yes, that's. I'm not shutting you down just because I say yes. That's not a. Th- yes. No, I know. I hate you so much. <laughs> not as much as I hate Nick. <laughs> Oh boy. Um. 
What about like the Bourne movie? Those aren't comedies. Those aren't comedies. Sorry, I said something. Don't hurt me. <laughs> Here, I'm just gonna let you do the rest of this then. No. Well, then I'll just ask him if it's true. <laughs> Well, um, is there anything else we could ask about that that would narrow that down, but also, if that's not it, would help us in some way? Is this movie made by Ooh. a well-known director? Like, that's a tough one. I know. It, Do you know this director's name? Does that help you? No, but like it. That you would think like Joe Schmo on the street would know. No. Okay. So it's probably not. So it's not, probably not Jurassic Park. I don't um, know Joe Schmo. <laughs> Comedy franchise. That's, Fourteen. No one asked. That started. That they're still making. So that's what's throwing me off. That they're still making, or something's coming out. Yes, you said within the past couple of years, <clears throat> though. All right. What's what's a recent comedy sequel that we've gotten? Bad Santa two. Yeah, but was, we've done, I think we've done Bad Santa. It was 2003. I, would, I did that. I would say, remember... The Titans? I remember, remember that sequel, still I remembering the Titans. The comedy question. Yeah, so you were like, eh, it's not... I don't want you to get too close. No, I know. But, like... Uh, I, I really have not. I don't know. Yeah, well, that's because Nick sucks at picking movies. No. Just for the sake of time, I would say maybe think of actors that were popular during this time. Or All right, Richard. You know, I think we should think of actors that are popular here. during this time. We're almost at a minute per question at this point. No one's asking. Um, Who are some famous 90s actors? But see, it's the comedy thing that's... Is well, this, don't this, think well, about here, the comedy. Know, Forget I, about it. I know. I'm going to try to narrow down another genre. Maybe uh, that'll help. I think you should think of actors. But I'm trying to think of a group that would... Because Ocean's Eleven is a little late, but you might be able to still get away. Was anybody from the cast of Ocean's Eleven in this movie? No. Fifteen. So that eliminates a lot of people. Okay. Who else was in the 90s? I don't know. It could be something... St I don't want to say stupid, but, like, the sequels were stupid. Like, a night, like you know, something like Sandlot, where they, within the last few years, put out a Sandlot 3. Yeah. But that would... I would, I would say that it's a family movie. Like, I wouldn't have a hesitation of saying that's... Okay. So let's keep going. But it could be like one of those sports team. Does this movie have anything to do with sports? No. So it's probably not one of those. <laughs> Go ahead, yell at me. I'm not. I'm not yelling at you. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So what else? What else? Come on. Let's think. Think. What do you have? I can't, I did, can't really think of things. <laughs> um, does this movie have anything to do with, does it, does it revolve know. around a school? No. So it's adults. Mm -hmm. 17. Um, I, I really have no idea. I'm going to say odds are, as I've probably never heard of this movie. I mean, we could ask if you've seen it. But that usually doesn't help because I don't yeah, but remember he, all the ones. Yeah, but I've if seen. he doesn't know, it's a free question. <laughs> so then why bother asking? It? Independence Day. Um, that's that has funny things in it. 
Yeah, I Does just it? made a new one. Okay, yeah, I'm but sure I would argue. You could argue. Do you bring that to? Do you bring your family to that? Does this movie involve? Wait, you're just gonna go with it? Wait, did we narrow everything down? No. What do we? Uh, but we gotta ask something. All right, Does this movie good. involve? Um, or is would this also maybe be considered a science fiction movie? Yes. Mm, so it could be Independence Day. Are there any people 18. in that that are in Ocean's Eleven <clears throat> or on Saturday Night Live? Not that I know of. I, don't, I mean, I haven't seen it. It's been a long time to see it. It's the only people that come to mind. You've got Randy Quaid, Bill Pullman, and Will Smith. Could be a Will Smith. It could be, ooh, 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 Men ooh. Could be Men in Black. Is that sci-fi, I guess? Yeah. There's yeah, there's aliens. I guess. What are we at? We're at 18? So this next question is 19. So why don't you just ask Will Smith? Because that... That either really helps us or uh, it puts us where we are in mm-hmm. anyways. Is Will Smith in this movie? He is. Oh, but that was our last question? Mm-hmm. Sorry, I looked at you. I'm, I'm going to go with Men in Black. Because I would consider that more of a comedy family. family. family movie. Is this movie Men in Black? It is. <laughs> good job! Yes. We did so good. Another last question. <sighs> but we got closer on that one than we did you and i did for love actually yeah but you didn't technically get love actually because you went over I'll it. Check the i don't buy that I'll check we're the gonna tapes. go back and we're gonna look um so next week will either be dana's choice or my choice if you have suggestions for me you can email those to us at overabeerofficial at gmail.com or tweet at me i'm on twitter at rich belson you can tweet at her suggestions she's at dana explains or you can tweet at him if you just feel like it which you probably <laughs> wouldn't What's the new... I don't remember there being a new Men in Black. They had Men in Black 3 a few and years ago, and there's, there's discussion... There's perpetual rumors of, of 21 Jump... Jump Street meets Men in Black. Yeah. In development. Actually, it has a director that James Bobbin is attached to. That's that. right, yeah, yeah, yeah. So... Um, you can also find the channel on Twitter at OABeer underscore official. Find us on Facebook at o- Facebook.com slash over a beer. Instagram is over underscore a underscore beer. Of course, right here on YouTube at YouTube.com slash over a beer. Um, we did just see Rogue One last week, two weeks ago, whenever this goes up. Um, so we have a review of that up. And you can also check out the Over a Beer podcast on iTunes, SoundCloud, and other podcast services of your choice. That'll wrap things up for today, though. So until next time, drink up. And butter me up. Bye.